Hey, it's Pivotal here. We are back and we're making Heaven's Headlines as usual. And we're here to talk today about our voices. You know, it's so it's so crazy because the last time I came on, I talked about the slave Tetris game and the whole slave trade game being made like an online game about the Atlantic slave trade. Totally crazy. And today I want to talk about something else. The fact that that got no backlash is what I was dealing with. Today I want to talk about somebody who got backlash for something that she said um, a while ago, back in July. Clarissa Pinkston uh, is a model with, uh, she was a model with Rihanna's clothing line, and she made a statement that being transgender does not make you a woman. It simply makes you transgender. She got so much backlash from the transgender community that she came out and said she was transgender and she wasn't. <laughs> you know, she said it so that they would get off her back. She could possibly get her job back but the bottom line was she had to go back and say no you know I'm not I apologize I had the pressure on me I'm talking about this because it's so amazing to me that some communities have become a centralized voice where they have a loud opinion and a loud soapbox and you cannot say anything about them and yet you have people who are um, in third world countries right next to us are going through things you know in Haiti right now there's chaos that are not in the media and anything can be said about them because they don't have the resources that's a problem I'm also in the news today we're talking about a picture of a doll that showed up on the internet the first transgender doll went on sale in a Russian toy shop that's a problem it's dressed in a dress and under the dress is a penis and so that is the voice that's loud and talking to the children and so as Christians those of us who are Christ-like ones who have a voice why is saying Jesus is the only way to the Father something that's considered closed-minded well if if I can't have the voice to say that, and yet you can have the right to make a doll with a dress and a penis, and Clarissa doesn't have the right to say being transgender does not make you a woman, it makes you simply transgender, then where does the voice come from? Well, the bottom line is this. We shouldn't be shut down because of our beliefs. Nobody should. Everyone should have the right. My issue is that when believers stand and take the, the stance that we take, we're considered those who are exclusive. We are considered those who have a problem with other people. But we have a voice too. That's the whole point of this pivotal. Listen, guard your hearts, guard your children, and train them up in the way that they should go lest they fall victim to the voices that are coming at them through media and through all of these other places. It's pivotal. Drop a line below. Let me know what you think about the voice. Let me know what you think about what should have a backlash. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Hey, listen, before we go, I want to let you know that I'll be doing a special It's Pivotal that I want you to tune in for at the end of this month. I'll be looking at the nature of war and conflict, not just the, the present deal with Iran, but some of the things that are coming up in our nation. Tune in and look forward to seeing you there. It's a special It's Pivotal coming direct at you the end of this month.